Everything seems to be in order here. <laughs> Sam, look over there. How dare you call in the authorities without consulting me? Well, I tried talking to you, but you were off wallowing in your own self-pity. Yeah, but... It's them! Hi, I'm Chef Cushman, and this is my brother Burl. Welcome to our carnival. What's left of it? <laughs> I'm Sam. He's Max. We savagely protect the rights of innocence. <laughs> Even cruelly twisted ones such as yourself. Selves. Whatever. Well, you sound like just the guys to solve our little problem. Walk this way. See this melted block of ice? How could we miss it? This used to be our main attraction. Huh. Your main attraction was a block of ice? <laughs> Don't be dense. Our main attraction was a genuine, authentic, real life, Bigfoot on ice. Hey, let me get this straight. You want us to go traipsing all over the country looking for a soggy Bigfoot? I've never been traipsing before. Does it hurt? <laughs> but Bruno must be returned to us. He's a brutish, ignorant beast with no sense of right or wrong. Hey, who isn't? <laughs> Besides, he's kidnapped our second main attraction. Is that the block of ice? No, it's Trixie the giraffe neck girl from Scranton. What? She disappeared at the same time Bruno did. We can only assume that the monster took her when he made his escape. I guess Max and I could search for your missing freaks, but we'll need free run of the carnival to look for clues. Yeah, and free coin dogs, so we can you call over ourselves. <laughs> no problem. Here's an all-day free pass. Give everything to us, and we'll have those abominations of nature back in your protective care before you can read the Koran. <laughs> Didn't he fight Godzilla? <laughs> I mean, that was misspelt, but I get what I mean. Hmm. It's a mange-ridden tuft of Bruno's Sasquatch hair. I think it would make a swell toupee for balding computer programmers. <laughs> Don't be stupid, Max. <laughs> hmm. Ugh. It's a melted ice block. I can't pick that up. <laughs> so this is what happens to unsuccessful third-party presidential candidates. <laughs> I can't pick that up. <laughs> Jesse James severed hand. And it's still twitching. <laughs> Why would I want Jesse James' severed hand? You know what? What about the gun? Take the gun. I mean, I mean, he's got his own gun, but... How Kafkaesque. <laughs> Hi? Oh, God. Jesse James severed hand. And it's still twitching. <laughs> I can't use... I can't use the... I can't use these things together. Hi. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Good needs to sort of translate, aren't we? Bye.
He's a nice guy, but sort of a drip. Ugh. I can't pick that up. Hi? <laughs> yeah, we're not gonna get anywhere with that, are we? He looks delicious. <laughs> Hi? <laughs> Great. He's not my type. Uh, which one do I talk to? Me! Me! Him! Him! <laughs> okay, so let's see. Is there anything else you can tell us about your escape Bigfoot? Well... He's a Bigfoot. He's escaped. He's a menace to society. <laughs> what more could you possibly need to know? He's right, Sam. I don't think my colossal head could retain any more knowledge. <laughs> What can you tell us about Trixie? She's a very caring, sensitive young woman. If you care about that kind of stuff. She used to sing folk songs to the other freaks in her trailer. You ever heard a Scrantonese folk song? No. You don't want to. <laughs> oh, there was one other thing. Mm -hmm. She likes her men like the Statue of Liberty. Green and rusty? <laughs> Tall and dense. Ha! Huh. Who are those guys we bumped into out by the gate? Uh, what guys? One was a short guy with big hair. The other one was a tall guy with big hands. Oh, you must be talking about internationally renowned recording star Conroy Bumpus. And his assistant, Lee Harvey. Bumpus? Who's Conroy Bumpus? He's a loon. Insane. And a country and western singer, the boot. <laughs> he actually wanted to buy Bruno and Trixie from us. Boy, was he steamed when he found out that we didn't have them anymore. Ha. Huh. That's interesting. I would have thought if he was responsible for kidnapping them, then, uh, hmm. Where do you buy your clothes, anyway? These aren't clothes. Our skin is naturally green and vinyl-like. Yeah. He's buck naked. So are you. Yeah, but I'm cute and marketable. <laughs> I mean, he's correct, isn't he? I'll bet life is an unending torment for you guys. Actually, it's not so bad. Speak for yourself. <laughs> well, it's back to the Bigfoot hunt.